Hello and welcome to my channel, I'm Avid Gamer. This is season 2 of my top 10 plays. Uh, probably the little mini series that brought most people to my channel. It's what I first uh, started making when I first started editing on my PS4. And uh, yeah, so anyway, I'm making a return to it. Now these clips, uh, there's a little mixture of uh, some short clips and some longer clips. Just trying to show uh, more sort of varied... Uh, sort of clips of uh, my gaming style just to uh, show what I'm really like as a player so let's get started number one Shamal Malafal so uh, just in the St. Charman tank here uh, see a bomber he's getting attacked he looks like he's going down I'll just start to uh, fire some shots hoping to get him he starts pulling up and yeah I got lucky <laughs> So uh, I don't really go in the tanks too often, so I was really happy when I got this. I thought he was about to go down there, but you see him just start to pull up. So I start to turn, raise my shot, and uh, yeah, get lucky. So that was number one, Shamal Malafal. Number two, out of gas. So uh, I see a shock trooper down there. I uh, have an opportunity to get the bipod down, so I'll do that. Finish him off. Reload, uh, start making a push up here. I've got a little uh, idea in my brain about throwing some gas and laying out some dynamite on this edge here. So that's what I do. Uh, getting ready for them, but they come straight away. So, oh, there we go. Get two kills. Decide to go for the horsemen here instead of the big group of guys that are right in front of me. So uh, I don't know what happened there, but it, worked, it works out all good in the end. Uh, all the grenades start coming in. I'm behind the wall. So uh, just get into cover. Wait for my health to start go up. Reload my gun again. I'm uh, gonna turn now, take a little look, I see a sniper, start laying into him. I get tagged from the left, there we go. Uh, so I'm gonna uh, target these guys now, pick up two more kills, which is nice. I go to start making a run because a lot of fire comes in, but I go straight into a, gla uh, a gas cloud. So um, yeah, that was nice. So this was number two, out of gas. Number three, now I have an IMG, ho ho ho. So uh, if you don't get that joke, uh, go watch some John McClane from the original Die Hard movie and uh, it should all make sense. So uh, using the IMG here, we're on Achibaba, or Achibaba. And uh, yeah, a lot of gas, a lot of smoke, but I'm just laying into this corner here and uh, yeah, I just picked up like six kills, uh, including an assist or something. So that was nice, uh, really loving this gun. Uh, pick up another two here or something. So yeah, it's a really good gun. I suggest you uh, give it a go if you haven't tried it. I prefer it over the factory version, uh, especially with this little triangle sight. Uh, it's really good for up close. So this was number three. Now I have an IMG, ho ho ho. Number four. PTO, like a Ross. So uh, we're on Amien here. And uh, we're pushing the D flag now. We've got push back here, so it's time to uh, start uh, getting our act together and uh, get this flag back off him. So I took out two guys here. There's two more around the corner. I throw a grenade, set them on fire, or set one of them on fire. I don't manage to uh, finish them two guys myself. Uh, my teammates get them, but I pick up another assist kill. So that counts to my score, so that's all good. Uh, miss a shot on an assault player there. So I know that he's still round to my left slightly, so I'll run up there now after this medic's gone. Have another quick little look. I see the support, uh, the assault guy, and then I see a scout, so I shoot the scout. Then I shoot the assault guy. Someone else takes out the scout, I get the assist, then I see a medic, so I take him down. That's all good. Believe me, uh, that was confusing when I first tried to record this. <laughs> I had to uh, redo this take there because I totally got the order of how the troops went down, but never mind. So I uh, just reloaded my gun, I put out my flares into the corners that I like to put them in, just so I can see people coming. I look down this uh, street here, see a medic, get a couple of hits on to finish, see a couple of more guys, get the shock trooper with two hits, so that's nice. Spot another medic, don't get a hit on him, but he's spotted now, so you know, get the spot assist, so that's all good, and the suppression assist, so I'm all happy with that, still gaining points. Make a little push forward here. Yep, see a couple of guys in this alleyway here, so I spotted them. 
I don't manage to get any hits, but uh, I start laying off rounds, just hoping to keep them suppressed. Uh, going through my ammo quite a lot with this Ross gun recently, uh, just because of the reload speed, and then I pick up a little shock trooper down there. We also picked up the flag at the end, so that's how you be PTO, like a Ross. Uh, no, number four, by the way, as well. I probably should have said that. Five! Freezer crowd. So this is a little bit of a clip, a, a quick clip here, but I'll pick up a headshot and then another. So two headshots really close to each other. And then I see a little shock trooper over there and then finish him off as well. So this was number five, freezer crowd. Number six, getting pushed. So we're on Passchendaele here. Uh, get a little quick kill to start with. Miss on the uh, the medic there, but I get the support player just before he gets the cover with a headshot. So that was nice. Shoot the medic who picked up another player there. So uh, you know, that's important. Always try and get the medic. Get another support guy there. Get another medic. Uh, don't manage to get the scout, I don't think. No, he gets the cover, that's right. Uh, I see a grenade come in now, so I know they're close to me. I turn around, and unfortunately, just a little bit too late to uh, get the support guy. And uh, I picked up a trip mine from the outside there that I put down previously, but I didn't need to show that. So this was number six, getting pushed. Number seven, good innings. So this is probably the longest clip of uh, of the week. Uh, I've flanked the enemy here, so I'm, I'm on their side of the flag. I've got in behind them. I'm just hoping to cause a little bit of mayhem, spot as many people as I can, take out a few, whilst also trying to be a decent spawn point for anyone who might uh, sort of realize what I'm up to and ho hopefully join in in the mayhem. So I've picked up a few kills so far. I've got another one there. Uh, it's a little bit campy, but it's really good. You know, like, I'm, cause, I'm causing mayhem now. I know people are going to be coming for me in a minute, but I'm still picking up kills. I've decided just to push how long I can stay here for. Get another support guy here. He manages to get a gas grenade, and uh, he makes me move. So I run away here just, uh, just for a minute. It's probably time to move now anyway, because I know people are probably going to be uh, coming back and looking for me. They, I took out a good bunch of people there. So I turn to my left here, just because someone gets taken down, but he, he decides to skip by the time I realise. Uh, so I know there's someone over here, I've got to have a quick little look. There he is, finish him off with a couple of bullets, that's all good. See my sniper up there needs some uh, health, so I'll go back to where I was previously, just to drop him a little health pack. There you go buddy, have another quick little look. Now it looks like our flag's getting taken here, it looks like our team's got it in hand, so I decide to uh, just sit doing what I'm doing. Managed to finish off a sniper there, or someone else finishes him. But I pushed him into the position where uh, he got taken out, so that was good. Uh, have a little quick look round, because I'm really uh, thinking that people are coming for me now. That's when I noticed that the D flag is now getting taken over by the enemy, so all my teams got killed. I'm like, oh, what? We just had it nearly. Start pushing forward. Eventually, start pushing forward. <laughs> and... Uh, Yep, yeah, have a little opportunity to put my bipod down, see a little sniper, don't get any hits on him, but I know he should be coming around to the left any minute now. So I throw my grenade in. There's the sniper. He's off, he, he decides to scarper. I managed to get the uh, assault player inside the building. My support guy gets taken out there. I'm gonna run over to go get him, but he decides to skip. I'm going over anyway. I swear I'd, I'd nearly get taken out by a horse there, but I was very lucky. So I'm inside the smoke now, the horse guys threw a couple of grenades at me, he only managed to get a clip on me with one of them. Uh, I nearly take him out there, so he scarfers. Very low in health now, but I can hear footsteps, so I go around here to my left, see a assault guy and then another one, managed to take them out, so that's all good. I get into cover here again, go to reload, hear more footsteps, so oh, this little assault guy's came in and he takes us out with a little suicide dynamite. So a bit of a long clip, but I really wanted to show uh, a little bit more of my, my gameplay rather than just a couple of clips. So this was number seven, good innings.
Number eight. So, uh, unknown distance. We'll run Zebrugi, Zebrugu, however you say this map. I take out the guy in the boat when I get clipped by what I thought was a sniper shot. I'm not sure. So I'll have a little look up there. I roughly see where it's coming from. I take a shot that's way off. Take a second shot. A little bit of a delayed reaction to get there. I'm not sure the distance, but my, my zero is set to 300 meters. So quite pleased with that. This was number eight, unknown distance. Number nine. Holding on. So I've got down into the bombs here, trying to protect them. Took out their support guy. Run over to the bombs, keep having a little look. Chuck a grenade over that way. Spin round quickly just over here, just to uh, check if everything's all sweet. I go to lie down here, but I see people come in through the door. So there we go, I've got to open up. Three of them got in. Four of them got in. I'm not sure how many have been killed. There's one there, there's two. So I've got them two. There's another one there, so I shoot him. Another one comes in the door. So that was nice. Get four little quick kills there. So uh, all happy with that. I run over here to throw a limp it, but nothing comes of it. So that was the end of that. So uh, very happy my gun didn't overheat for too long here. Otherwise, I think I would have been dead. But um, managed to survive and uh, managed to get the clip. So very happy with that. This was number nine, holding on. Number 10, where's my limpet? So uh, yeah, I love this clip. So uh, playing operations here, just about uh, to capture the flag. So they're all running at me. I've picked up two kills. They're all starting to run past me now, uh, coming towards me. I got to throw a limpet, but then realized that I've got my repair tool. Uh, managed to take that guy out there and then got the pry bar kill on this guy. Really, really lucky that I survived that. Cause uh, yeah, unfortunately, like I say, I had my bloody spanner instead of my, my little limpet mine. So anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this. This was number 10, where's my limpet? Hope you've enjoyed the video. Uh, please leave your favorite in the comments if you have one. And uh, I'll see you soon.